science indicates that global warming may not be all you think. A Global Warming Primer is a fact-based educational publication available to schools and the public, just published by the National Center for Policy Analysis. This easy-to-use, informative guide presents simple facts about the Earth's climate and temperature. These facts will help you form a grounded opinion regarding future policy proposals. NCPA Senior Fellow H. Sterling Burnett. Research shows that over the Earth's multi-billion year existence, there's been no close relationship between carbon dioxide and temperature. And during the Jurassic period, when dinosaurs roamed the Earth, the Earth was about 18 degrees warmer than today. Despite constant research and improving knowledge, scientists know relatively little about the factors that affect climate and temperature. Many scientists worry that global warming will cause stronger hurricanes, increase coastal flooding, and cause species that cannot adapt to warming to go extinct. Yet sea levels are rising at a slower rate now than they have on average since the end of the last ice age. It seems unlikely that polar bears will disappear since polar bear populations have risen steadily since the 1950s. Indeed, at 25,000 bears, the population is higher now than at any time in the 20th century. Hurricanes cost far more today than in the past because of more people and greater development on the coasts. But hurricanes are neither more numerous nor more powerful than before. Though there have been few visible consequences of global warming, laws and treaties have been proposed to prevent or reduce it. These proposals would be expensive and do little or nothing to prevent future harms. One congressional proposal, the Waxman-Markey Bill, will reduce U.S. greenhouse gas emissions by 83% below their 2005 levels by 2050. Even if the U.S. meets this goal, the Earth would be only slightly cooler. However, meeting Waxman-Markey's goals would require people in the United States to reduce their per capita CO2 emissions to levels not seen since the 1860s when people had no electricity, cars or planes, phones, televisions, radios, computers or other electronics. The impact that human activity has had on the environment and temperature rise is still an open question. All we know for sure is that efforts to reduce CO2 increases by limiting energy use will cost billions to trillions of dollars and harm lives while doing little or nothing to prevent future warming. The Global Warming Primer is available online. Bulk printed copies are also available for schools and other educational organizations.